It's silent, it's invisible, and well, it's one of the most advanced war machines ever built. This is the B-2 Spirit America's secretive stealth bomber. Developed by Northrop Grumman, the B-2 Spirit entered service in the 1990s and remains one of the most lethal and stealthy aircraft in the world. It's designed to penetrate deep into enemy territory, undetected. Stealth, precision, power. The B-2 uses radar-absorbing materials, special coatings and a flying wing design that makes it nearly invisible to radar. It's not just another bomber, it's a ghost in the sky. Even thermal imaging finds it hard to detect this beast. The B-2 isn't just stealthy, it's deadly. It can carry both conventional and nuclear weapons. From JDAMs to B-61 and B-83 nuclear bombs, this bomber can strike with devastating precision. With mid-air refueling, the B-2 has, you know, true global reach. It's flown non-stop from the United States to Afghanistan and back, dropping bombs with, well, pinpoint accuracy. It has quietly participated in major conflicts across the globe, often before the world even knew it was there. The Spirit is equipped with top-secret navigation and electronic warfare systems. Even decades after its debut, its technology still honestly baffles military analysts. With a price tag of over $2 billion per unit, the B-2 is one of the most expensive aircraft ever built. But to the Pentagon, stealth supremacy is, frankly, priceless. You don't fly the B-2, you wear it. Every mission, every second, the jet and the pilot become one. Stealth comes at a cost, not just in dollars, but in time. Each B-2 requires hundreds of hours of maintenance for every flight. Its stealth skin must be carefully treated and repaired. While the B-2 Spirit will eventually be replaced by the upcoming B-21 Raider, it remains the backbone of America's stealth strike capability, undefeated, unchallenged and unseen. The B-2 isn't just a machine, it's a symbol. A symbol of power, secrecy and futuristic warfare. As long as it flies, the skies belong to the spirit.